Hey guys, this is Kirob speaking and today we are back in Pro Cycling Manager 2019 with Enrico Civaldori. And I had someone in the comments point out, it is Kivaldori. Yes, yes that is correct. It would be Kivaldori. Like the uh, the name Chiara is not Chiara. But um, you know what? I don't care. Because this is the correct pronunciation according to Jagged Alliance 2 from back in the day. The German version of that game released first, more than half a year early than the English version, and Enrico Chivaldori was um, the one who hired you to do the job. So it is Chivaldori, not Kivaldori. But now, back to more important things, and those would be we have our fitness peak, and we do have a few races coming up. I'm still um, Rob McMucus, uh, uh, Heuschman, and I, I'm very, very coffee and have to uh, to cut out all kinds of nasty, nasty noises from these episodes. I hope so far I've caught them all. Uh, we have this little race in front of us, and then two back-to-back -back classics, very flat ones. Uh, yeah, for the most part. And then our first cobble climbing race, with very little cobble and very little climbing. And our fitness peak lasts to somewhere around here. There was also someone in the comments who pointed out that uh, the skills thing is really broken if you are uh, cur currently at the, in this patch. If you are leveling up your fitness peak duration, it resets the, um, the starting date to where you leveled it up. So you can have like one and a half months worth of fitness peak if you do it right. And maybe then you have another, you have another peak. <laughs> that would be so funny. Uh, you have uh, another skill point to put in there and then extend it to two months length. That uh, would be really funny. But no, we're not going for that. Uh, we have invested a point into stealth because stealthy attacks are basically what Dicky McSpeck has found out to be the best. And Dicky McSpeck is never wrong. This is a neat new feature. Look at that. Now the fitness peak is actually being shown up here in your schedule. Beautiful. So we can be guaranteed to have our fitness peak up to uh, basically this race. And there we turn it into a one point fitness peak. Or nothing if we are unlucky. Also pretty neat is this. Now you can see where you are specializing what you uh, chose at the various level ups. Uh, that's that's pretty nifty. And you can see that we did, did have a pretty solid level up last time. That was plus four in stamina, plus four in resistance and plus four in recovery. I am really worried right now that this is completely overpowered. Uh, that you are leveling up. Like if there really are 35 level ups from level one to 36. And it is going that way, as, as we have seen so far. Like massive, massive stat increases. And we are already at level four. We are already a decent rider. Look at this shit. 69 flat is decent, 66 mountain. Yeah, you can ride 66 mountain. You can you can partake in any stage race. You, you might not be uh, the, the top dog for sure, but uh, yeah, and then 69 hill, decent enough. Time trial, okay, yeah, we're not, not talking about that. Uh, cobblestones, yeah. Good, solid rider. Sprint, solid. Acceleration, of course, there. It's it's not irrelevant. Stamina already 60 fucking 8. Holy shit, as a level 4 rider. I think we are going to get that one up to our 85. And that might make it such that we even can run some stage races. Because it is a nice, interesting balance between stamina and recovery. The more stamina you have, the less your green bar you use during the stage, which means that you don't have to recover as much. And that means that you stay fresh for longer. So that means that um, as long as you have a decent number for recovery, which we currently don't, uh, then the stamina, if that is very high, really helps you out to uh, keep things going during a stage race. But we are, we are not talking about that. We are supposed to win all the monuments in this let's play but now enough blabbering garab let's get racing and there it is the plus two expected race day condition 
And what do we get? What do we get? Come on. Race day condition! Plus three! Yes! Holy statsamoly! That is quite fantastic. We are a decent rider today. Uh, yes, everything is very green. Stamina is 75 today. Oh my god. That is amazing. Now I just need someone. Piggy! Piggy! Could you please help me out, man? That would be fantastic. Oh, yes, yes, yes. We we can also see. Like, uh, uh, stop, stop it, guys. Uh, don't go too hard. I want to want to enjoy my uh, my ride through the sunny landscape with random cars parked uh, somewhere. Uh, anyway, yes, uh, you can see this thing here. This button up here, which doesn't look like a button, but it is a button. It says surprise opponents. Uh, Yes, surprise opponents can be pressed and then everyone around you goes like, Huh? Uh, and you can just do whatever and they can't react to you. Which is quite handy. And I think we might be able to try that out later on if we make a mech spec attack. There's still absolutely no one in my team who wants to help me. Which is a shame. There's still six SKPs up front, about a minute on the clock, but we are racing hard now. And still following along at a reasonably low heart rate. Which means that we should be saving quite a bit of energy for the final stint. Uh, there is a significant amount of wind though. So I will have to, if I'm going for- What? What the- Wait, wait a second. Wait a second. Holy shit, that is that is a bit of an obstacle right there, good sir. Why? Why Why, why would you put that in the middle of the road? Um, ver very well placed. Um, yes, so uh, the map, yes, and wind. If we are going for a spec attack in the finishing stages, and I think we, we probably could. I mean, we do have the stats for it. Sprint is decent today, though, so if it doesn't succeed, then um, it's not too bad. Oh shit, are they... Are they attacking or something? They're moving fast, so better up it to 85, I guess. And take position there. The group is oh yes, there was... That was correct. That was correct. Holy... They just broke off behind me. Attack Constant attacks going now. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to keep it at 85 for a moment. Stay with them here. Okay, they have settled down slightly. And we only have a bit of wavy terrain left over. Ah, this is the finish. Hmm, let's activate O. O, O. Well, slight side wind into. That does slow you down. And yes, we just passed the finish. There. It's a tiny indicator. And there the escapees have been caught. Right, let's, let's stay active here. Oh, 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 yeah, 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 they're trying. I was reading the situation well. I uh, anticipated them trying something. If they're trying to get away and actually succeed. Nope, they're not succeeding. We're just keeping with them. Crazy speed going here. If they keep up that speed, then I'm definitely not going to attack in the finishing kilometers. But if they are slowing down and just not taking it seriously, then I'm going to give it a go. Oh! Are we getting away now? Uh, this is, this is crazy hard riding now. Five riders. Now we have five riders. Okay. They are still going hard. And attacking and everything. Let's try to follow him instead. Oh, he's trying something, I believe. Uh, can I still blind them? No. Okay. You can't use this in the final few kilometers. So that just doesn't work. Um, are they still... Yeah, they are still pulling pretty hard. Or are they? Right now, I don't really want to go forward. Hmm... I do need to uh, get my energy bar, though. 
Uh, very important. Almost forgot about it, but the finish is slightly slower. It's uphill, so this should be about right. 13 seconds. They might be able to catch us. Yeah, there they come. It's into the wind. So attacks are... Oh, wait a second. Is he trying something? Follow him. Oh, are they going? This is a little nervous. No, no, no. Oh, this has slowed right down. This has slowed right down. If if my bar was active, I would probably try and have a go at it. Come on, someone make the first move. Ah, I'm in the lead here. Don't want to be. I really don't want to be. Come on, where's my bar? As soon as that kicks in, I'm, I'm going. There, okay. Now, they're 1.5 kilometers into the wind. That is triggering the sprint too early. Let's wait a little longer. There, there, someone is going. Yeah, okay. I need to sprint now. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Accelerate. Accelerate. Enrico. No. Go. Go. Uh, reacted slightly too late. Slightly too late. Still had a little bit of red bar left. Yeah, needed to um, trigger it about 100 meters earlier. We kind of got put there in the, the worst spot. And once our group, uh, our group of five was caught, everyone just for, uh, formed on me, and I had to take it from the front. And you're kind of between a rock and a hard place at that point, where if you initiate the sprint too early, uh, then you just run out and everyone overtakes you. If you initialize the sprint just about right, then everyone has your slipstream and will eventually overtake you. If you initialize the sprint slightly late, then it, you see what happened in our case here. But, I mean, it's still a top 10. And for that, oh nice, for that we get 42 points. Uh, this is a bit of a pancake. V very pan pancakey. Rotterdam to Utrecht. Ah, okay. But there we go. Plus two race day condition bias. And we shall see what we end up with. Okay, ideal ground for those who have a race day condition of plus two? We shall find out. Um, decent stats, again. Plus two race day condition is good. 73 stamina, so not quite as powerful as before. Do we have no helpers? Ah. <sighs> That doesn't make it any easier. We are not among the... Not among the favorites, though. And we are supposed to get into a breakaway and get into the top 15. Well, I can try to get to the front and maybe go with the second group. Uh, if I get there. No, 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 doesn't look like it. Oh, is there some movement to go into? Are ah, you looking... Looking like you want to try something. Herr Asselmann. Oh, follow attack. Here we go. Come on. No, come on. Uh, come on. No, for fuck's sake. Go. Don't, don't abort your attack all the time. Uh, no? You don't want to attack? All right. No? Come on. Come on. No? He's very indecisive. Oh, no. Ah, and now he got blocked. Oh, there, there's someone is going. Follow. Come on, Enrico, follow. No, are you fucking kidding me, you guys? Ah, I just want to follow some escape group. But no, doesn't seem like anyone wants to go once I'm on the rear. And what a beautiful breakaway that would have been. Four minutes on the clock. Ah. Too bad. So we're just gliding along. There's still 1 minute 40 on the clock at 56 kilometers remaining. Easy catch. Just two riders left up front, 24 seconds. They won't be getting anywhere. And the race has heated up a bit. Now I think there might be some splits coming. I better set this to 85 just to hang in there. And there the last little rider is caught. No chance indeed. Ooh, that was a big split. 60... Oh, no, no. You, Enrico. What are you doing? 
Don't get stuck behind slow riders. Oh, go, go, go. Go, 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 go. You need to close that foggy gap. Yes, good. Oh, man. That slow rider really almost got me. Yeah, it seems like the Peloton is not coming back. Not if they keep riding like this. And they have full sprint trains forming up front here. With Van der Poel. Oh, wow. This is really, really heating up. Oh, look at that. The finish line is interesting. Slide uphill. Mini hill. Oh, I already cannot use my stealth skill anymore. So the stealth skill really is only for getting into breakaways, it seems. Okay, some some guys are trying to push up to the front. Why is 70 enough to push over there? That seems odd. Okay, now they're accelerating again. Oh, they're actually... Oh, uh, so, someone is going! At five kilometers? Huh. Oh, there's another one. Follow him. Come on, follow him. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. This is good. I think I'm going to commit to this one. I'm so going to commit to this one. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Whatever happens here, just need to pull through. So this one, I need to be very careful. As soon as he got... Oh, or are these... Yeah. These guys are going even harder. Follow him. No, fuck, fuck! He isn't following. No, 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 no. Shit. Go. Go. Okay. Whew. Uh, so, okay. Uh, well, we committed, but that didn't lead anywhere. Three kilometers left. And a slight uphill finish line. I think the bee was a good sprinter, wasn't he? Oh, uh, can we follow him? Hello. There. Now. Uh, Krieger. Oh, this guy. Cool. Come on, bar. Trigger already. Yes. There it is. Perfect timing. Two kilometers before the finish. Now, someone launched a sprint. Yeah, he's going. He's going hard. He's going hard. Yes, yes, yes. Don't get stuck. There's the kilometer marker. Sprint. Go. Enrico, go. Oh, shit, you're slow. Come on, go. Yes. Uh, that looks like a fifth place. Ah, really okay. uh, our speed, our top speed is very low still, but that was well timed. I certainly had the right idea about whom to follow. The B1 and Krieger uh, came second. That should give us plenty of points. 33, all right, all right, fifth. We were supposed to get to top 15. Ah, yeah, okay, we didn't get the breakaway, so no additional points for that. And next up, slightly, slightly more hilly. Oh! Enrico! Enrico Chivaldori is among the favorites. Another plus two race day condition. And that means we have the same stats as before, more or less. Uh, this small field, just 106 riders, and still... No helpers, what's going on there? Uh, okay. Finish in the top 10. Objective, get some breakaway exposure. That doesn't quite fit together, does it? Not if we are favorite, too. Uh, are these guys looking to break away? I want to show you the, the stealth mechanic. I think this guy looks like he's going. Oh, there. No, no not quite yet. Still no attacks going. I'm really careful watching any kind of jabs they are doing. Nothing so far. I do have a little bit of a plan. Oh! That, someone is moving there. Let's move, move out here. No. No, he's not continuing. Let's check out these little hills. Uh, well. Mm, not the steepest of things. Uh... But the, uh, the finish is quite easy. The last 10 kilometers are mostly downhill. I think he's going. Uh, c come on. Uh, let's go 99. Let's go... Uh, c come on. Let's go 99. 99. Boop. No. No. 
No, attack! Boom! Yes. Uh, I only blinded two of them. Which is bad. Here we go. Uh, let's do some lead work. I assume they are chasing me like crazy. Yes, they are. Okay, we, we can't get away today, so it's, that's fine. So the range of our surprise attack um, is not really, really good just yet. It needs to be right where you want to blind people. You, you pop your flashbang and then you go on the attack. We were just doing that passing by at a too large distance, so yeah, they still could react. Whoa, everyone is riding hard. Look at that. Like we are limited at 60, but these are guys are going at 170 and we we've been keeping up with the main bunch though. Strange. Okay, now we are falling back. Oh, 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 now there's some movement. Now there's some proper movement. The escape group has just been reeled in and these guys were going on a brief attack. Oh no, Piggy has fallen. Oi. Oi. Oi, 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 oi. Oi, 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 oi. Someone, someone there has started an attack. Can we follow them? Can we? Yes, okay. Good. Good, good. Uh, they just accelerated. Oh, now they are going. Follow them. Whoop. Yes. That's uh, just shuffling. Shuffling around. Oh, they continue, though. I'm pretty sure that this thing is going to break apart on the next slope. 79 riders won't be in this peloton after that, if they continue riding like this. I'm a little tucked away here, that's not a good position to be in. There, oh, someone is going. Someone is going. Grifko! Oh shit, okay. Uh, yeah, if you need to follow him. Come on, go, go. No, no, what?! Stop your fucking switching off the attack when I say you attack! Okay, go, just attack then. Everyone is doing that though, so that's, that's all good. Just follow him then. Okay, okay. That was a failed attack. Oh, oh no, oh, what? I can't see anything! Don't, don't let them ride away. Good. Now, 6.7 kilometers left to go. Oh, they're trying to get away uh, we need to trigger our barn now because of how fast it is down down the hill there at this speed we are not going to get away and let's follow Grifko I, I believe that that might be the oh oh are we getting away yes six riders um can I can I uh, there's someone following me. Grifko's following me, but let's let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Sprint is on. Final kilometer. It is quite downhill, but there's a corner here. There's a corner here. Come on. Hold hold on there. No, no, no. Oh ah. Well, our teammate got it. That's good news. And we got third. I ran out of juice there. As expected, started sprinting too early, but the corner kind of saved us to uh, to hold up. So not a bad move overall. Tactically, we were in a good position, and when this group was forming, we were right at the rear of it. They were slowing down, and I just went 99 and tried to get as much as a tempo advantage before placing the attack and starting to sprint. And no one really could connect instantly, so that was good. That's pretty solid. Just too, too slow. Too slow and running out of energy. And Enrico Chevaldori is sprinting. Uh, no, not, not quite. Just riding fast. These guys are actually sprinting. He was really good. Really solid performance. It's weird how this five-man group formed there at the end. And, uh, that's racing for you. And I'm very happy with this result. There we go. Third, exceptional, breakaway, three kilometers, bad. <laughs> Here we don't get anything for um, our teammates positioning, which is odd. See, them won the race. That should give us some bonus, you would think. But 33 points, not too bad. Three quarters of the way there. 
Oh, it is the one. The one that we have been targeting. Light cobble, flat sprint finish. And we are not among the favorites. So maybe, maybe that means we can get away on an, on an escape group. Oh, oh, cobble sections, yes. Give them to me. Enrico, ship. Oh, for fuck's sake, Enrico. Just a plus one. That is bad. Objectives, finish in the top 30. Uh, that should be pretty easy. But, well, we are way far to the front. I'm going to try and get into the breakaway. So let's, let's see how that goes. Oh, there. Someone is going. Boom, attack. Yes. And we are off. And we are off. Perfect. Perfect. Here we go. And they are not reacting. So. We are... Oh, wait a second. 12 seconds. I think they are reacting. <laughs> Shit. So the question is, are they reacting because of me? I think the answer is yes. I think the answer is yes, because these other guys probably are... Uh, I, well, I, I can't tell. I haven't written the fucking database, you know, like some someone else. I wouldn't be able to tell you if these guys are any good. But, um, so we have been caught. We are not going to be let away today. That is unfortunate. That was the perfect attack, by the way. Uh, if they don't let us go at that point, then they they just won't. So I'm going to save my energy. Let's try and take a look at these little climbs. Um, um, yeah, it's not looking too bad. One thing that I'm noticing is that you can't tell what is cobbled and what is not. Oh, there's so much wind here today. Uh, 32 kilometers an hour average. That's pretty bad. So, probably for the best to actually stay in the peloton. And I think if they are racing hard towards the end, then that stuff will be breaking up in no time at these wind speeds. Especially in side winds. Okay, I think what we are going to do is try to get over these with as little pain as possible. So just... Take position up front, or aim to this take position up front, and limit yourself at 60. Because these climbs are so short that it shouldn't really matter. Well, that changes as soon as you reach cobblestone. That's a scary, scary thing, you know. So, scary, scary thing. Oh, everyone is blocking me, which is fine, because I'm in a terrible position and should have thought about that before. Um, go 75. Now we would need the eel technique to get through here. And we're just going 75. Where are the cobbles? Ah, oh, there they come. Yeah, easy going. Easy going. We have so much surplus speed if we need it. Yeah, I don't even have to, like, really chase them. And the peloton is broken apart already. Okay, this little climb is a repeat of that first one. Very mild. The interesting bit will be the next one, which will be raced at a higher pace than before. Cobbled climb coming up, this, a repeat of the second climb. And I need to be positioned even further up to the front for this one now. Just to be sure. This in general looks like a better position than what I had before. 85? It's probably appropriate. Come on, move, move up! Ah, uh, come, come on, move! Yeah, decent enough. If you don't get stuck there, should be fine. They're moving hard, They're moving hard. But I'm the cobbled climber expert. Oh, look at, look at me go, at 78, 85, I'm just annihilating them. Yes, easy, super easy. And again, the peloton is split into a thousand small groups. Uh, which is excellent, uh, but the wind has settled a little, so it's overall easier for people to catch up again and close gaps. So, all SKPs have been caught. 21 kilometers left to go. We are in a small 28 rider group. And let me just recheck the um, race strategy and objective. Top 30! Well, if we are keeping in this group, then we've already achieved that, but uh, I think we can do a little better than this. 
Ah, uh, I don't want to miss any bigger attack here. They they keep at it. They keep going. Yeah, this guy looks quite fast right now. Yeah, got his wheel. And now he's going. No, no, come on. Come on. Uh, no, no, he's going alone. He is not going to form that group. I'm not going to chase him. Uh, he is trying, though. This will be a little nervous. Oh, 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 oh. Is, is he going? Yeah, we may have to follow. Come on. Come on. Okay. They have settled down again. This is super nervous right now. Uh, come on. Get get through. Uh, yep. Mm, uh, it's a little hard. 11 kilometers left to go. Mostly downhill or flat from here on. We still have enough resistance to cover the distance, I believe. Oh, they are moving hard. Are they getting away? No, they are not getting away. But we are a, we are keeping them shadowed. Oh, this is a little nervous and, and weird. He's attacking. Who's following? Who is following? Is anyone trying to? Is anyone trying to follow right now? Let's attack and see what... Oh, uh, someone is going. Someone is going. We are sprinting away. And now let's just go 90. Five kilometers left. 15 seconds. That's not enough. But maybe they're indecisive. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. They are, they are following along. They are following along. Ah, oh, damn it. I don't have anything left. I don't have any red bar left. Oh, also, I need to... Da damn it. Forgot to trigger my... Oh, now everyone is following me. Ouchies. Ouchies. Gives us some time to get red bar back, but... Uh, two kilometers. This is going way too slow. At least... Ah! Oh, someone is going. Come on, follow him. Yes! Yes, yes, yes. We did get something out of that. Ooh, that could have ended a lot worse. So we do have still a decent position despite us not having full red. He's sprinting, he's sprinting, he's sprinting. And I need to... Uh, map, map, what are you saying? Is this a corner coming up or not? There is the finish right there. What? Where are we even riding? Uh, so straight across the road. Yeah, it's over there. I don't think my red bar will last that long, but he seems to be slowing down. So I think I am in the tough spot where I have to press the sprint button now. Oh, come on! Move move out to the side! There! Come on! Yes! Oh, that, that's, that, that's pretty good! Ah, sixth! Yeah, not enough. Not quite enough, but a decent result after the failed attack you know, on the final six kilometers. So many mess missed opportunities, but uh, overall, I'm quite happy with the outcome. This was a super nervous end to a stage. And the favorite did take it. 42 points. Yeah, not bad at all. Oh, uh, we still have our partial uh, fitness peak at this point. And slightly hilly stage, slightly hilly flat stage. Or do we? Wait a second. Oh, preparation, yeah, just just one. Just plus one. Ooh, this sounds very windy. Uh, that will make the race quite interesting. Plus one race day condition. So we got a, a reroll to zero. That's always decent. All right. Fairly hilly, actually. These hills are not the steepest. But, plentiful. And the finish line is ever so slightly uphill. About 2 to 3 percent, it looks like. Uh, more like, yeah, two, yeah, 2 to 3 is about right. So, uh, a slow sprint. Yeah, I'm not going to join any breakaway here. Uh, this is not, not the day for it. 39 kilometers an hour wind. That's crazy. Unless it's tailwind, then it's really good for the, for the escapees. Let's check that real quick. Oh, it is tailwind! Ah, oh, man. But it's probably not Tailwind for the whole time. Let's uh, check that. 
Mm, no, actually, it is pretty much for the whole time. Not there. It really matters. And, oh, yeah. Okay. And we're moving pretty quickly, aren't we? Yeah, we are. I think over these climbs, overall, we're saving quite a bit of energy with our 68 mountain stat and 71 hill stat. The hill stat isn't really used in those... Um... Oh, whoa! Now something has happened. We just lost contact here for a moment. Uh, they were chasing hard. I assume that this is going to go back very soon. Yes, it is. Very good. Why aren't you moving? Why are you moving at, like, no speed? Okay. Now. Now, and you're back connected. All right. Everything is fine. Probably worth staying pretty far forward. Even though the wind is starting to die down. As you can see, it's just dropping down there. It's 29 now. It was 39 at the start. Oh, yeah, what I wanted to say about the hill rating and the mountain rating. Uh, the mountain rating is, seems to be used for uh, for climbs that um, are ridden at a lower pace, and then the hill stat for, for those that are ridden, slopes that are ridden at a higher pace. And this looks like a peloton split, and we are on the correct side of it, which is good. They are moving like crazies. 85 is just barely enough to hang on here. And the wind has picked up again. 36 now. They are starting to attack, I believe, are they? No, that's from the escape group. Just a single rider left up front. He's going to be eaten for dinner. Uh, 11 seconds, 7 seconds, done. Let's have a look at the final climb. Yeah, reasonably steep, actually. So, we need to make it over that one. Um, in a good position. Because the peloton, for sure, will rip across it. And then the sprint needs to be launched late. Oh, they they are going. They're going hard. Yeah, but no one is really attacking, are, are they? No, I do want to follow you. Yeah, they have accelerated. Just, oh, come on, follow him! Oh, someone attacking there. Is he getting away? 14 kilometers away from the finish. That doesn't seem like a good idea. 43 riders still with us. Downwind. But why are they moving so slowly if this is... Like, this is so unrealistic. Uh, they would be moving at much higher speeds. This is al almost no wind, no headwind for, uh, like... I I in the frame of reference of that front rider, he only has 14 kilometers an hour of wind. Not even that. Uh, 11 kilometers an hour of wind. Basically nothing. There's almost no wind resistance. Okay, two tight turns. Ooh, oh, well, this could be interesting. Um, so we have two tight turns here, down here, tight turn, and then probably map drawing skills by PCM. Just place the most important thing somewhere out in the void. I think there might be a, a corner here, 90 degree. And then the finish sprint is another kilometer or so. Oh, are they trying to get away? Really? Let's follow them. So, tight corner. Oh! We are in a little group here now. They need to close the gap. Let's see if they are able to. Yes, we are away! Okay, I need to trigger my... my gel. Five kilometers left to go. This is looking really, really interesting. If they are pulling through. They are trying really hard there in the back, but I'm still, still in, wow, they are fast. They are really fast there behind. Now it is on him, basically. Oh, someone, I think they, they have, have some issues following us, actually. No, there they are, but this guy looks like he has way more speed. 60? He's going 60, and we're going 39. I don't want to be caught out by that. Let's accelerate. Let's accelerate. And follow him. Yes, caught his wheel. And he's even faster. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Oh, no, 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 we are... Mm. This is too early. This is too early. Follow him instead. Follow him. This is still going pretty well. We have our bar active. 
There's the kilometer marker. Uh, let's go 95. There's the... Yeah, 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 yeah. There's the corner coming. I mean, I kind of have to sprint now with the corner here. Otherwise, I would not be able to catch them, but... Oh man, this is way too long. Come on, sprint! Go! No! No! We just died there on the last few meters. No. Yeah, started sprinting way too early. That would have been an 800 meter sprint, optimally. Ouch. 13th. Well, 13th. Our teammate made 4th, which is decent enough. And we got 33 points. Uh, well, top 30 was the, uh, the the goal. Could have done better there, but ah, it was rough. It was rough. I pulled the trigger too early. But this means we get a level up to round off this episode. And ah, next level. Now it says access to 2HC and 1HC races. Level 5, skill point, and of course, choosing something juicy. Well, well, look at that. This is both a, um, let's say, relief that, uh, that it isn't as crazy overpowered as I uh, thought it might be. We don't get a massively good level up here. Only seven points. That is quite weak. This one is one of the, the better ones. Let's see. This, uh, no, not pro. The climber one. Plus one, plus one, plus one. Barodeur doesn't really count. Stamina plus one. Resistance plus two. Recovery plus one. So that's basically the strongest one out of them. The other one that is decent is the Northern Classics one. Plus flat, hills, time trial, cobblestone, sprint, and stamina resistance. But just plus one there. So I think what we are going to do is evolve our potential. And in what, you might wonder? Well, as we've discussed already, probably in... Uh, where is it? Puncher! Here. We don't need to time trial stuff. Uh, cobble, we can sacrifice one point in cobble. And we do get a potential increase uh, of plus two in mountain, hill and acceleration. That is pretty good. So yes, let's go for it. Instead of uh, doing a 7 point level up, let's do a 6 point potential increase. There we go. And now, just because we need to try it out, let's put 1 point into Fitness Peak. Our Fitness Peak has run its course, as you know, so let's see what happens if we do that. Increase the duration for our next Fitness Peak. Uh, from 22 to 26 days, or rather, no. Currently it is from 18 to 22, and we will increase it for, to 22 to 26. Now let's check that one on. That will definitely come in handy. This seems to be the strongest skill overall. And if we take a look at our calendar, or rather training... Oh, no. It didn't actually affect the, uh, the ongoing duration of this one. Which is a shame, of course, but... Uh, uh, that's how it's supposed to be. I um, thought someone said that uh, it would reset the the starting date. It doesn't seem to be the case, at least when you're running off the scale. So that that will make sense. Um, anyway, we do have our next fitness peak coming up for the for the um, young rider Paris Roubaix. So that would be good. And our fitness fitness training curve is just looking um, pristine. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed and see you guys next time.